Mary's life demands to be told as much for the crime that took her life as for the life that she lived, the memories that she gave to people while she was here. Those two things come together in a very powerful narrative. Mary was joyous. She was a prankster. Uh, she loved a good joke. And she was friendly to everyone. I haven't heard anyone say a single bad thing about Mary Tanner. So the combination of having Mary Tanner as a compelling figure in the middle of all of this and wanting to, to explore the impact of that crime on a small town 37, 36, 38 years later um, told me that perhaps there was, there was a documentary film here. The journalism in this story begins with what happened that Friday night and we really want to know because that is how we're going to build the story of what happened to Mary. What we need now is for Mary's friends to come forward and share their memories with us, not only of Mary in everyday life, but we really want to know what happened to Mary that Friday night. In many ways, this story could be called Mary and Friends because it's really about the friends that Mary left behind, the lives that they have led, in the years since her death, and yet how her death has lingered in their lives and colored their lives all along the way. So many of them have never really had closure around Mary's death. It isn't something that they were able to forget. M Mary was profoundly memorable, and th these people remember her very well. The thing that we have to remember here is that the Tanner family is reliving this nightmare of 37 years ago. And we're really asking a lot of them to go back and remember those times. One of Mary's friends that we were interviewing, uh, turns out she is an intuitive, uh, not to say a psychic. And she recounts how she began having dreams about Mary uh, in about 2007, I believe, memory serves, and the memories and dreams became so prominent that she, that she started writing them down. And later she approached uh, the state police and shared that information with them. I'm not sure how much it adds to the story. Um, it's a bit of a sensationalism, in my opinion, uh, to exploit that though it, I'm not exactly sure that I would want to discount it entirely either. If anybody out there saw Mary anywhere that weekend, we want to hear from you. We'd really appreciate it. You can be an important part of making this film if you share what you know. We need people to come forward and tell us. Thank you.